Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, today I'm going to be doing a natural, everyday kind of makeup look. Um, just a little disclaimer, I'm not a makeup artist at all. I've just self-taught off watching YouTube videos. Um, I am hoping to do a makeup course at the start of next year, so we'll just go with what we already know. And yeah, let's jump into it. Okay, so every time I do my makeup, I like to put these little cat ears on, which I actually used one time as a Halloween costume and it just came in perfectly for doing my makeup. Um, to start off, I always moisturise my face and I use the Cetaphil Acne Prone Skin Moisturiser. Um, so I just take a few pumps of that and rub it in. I find moisturising my face before... Um, applying my makeup definitely helps it stay on during the day. Um, I also find that sometimes I get very dry um, if I don't moisturise before putting makeup on. I hate that dry feeling underneath. So yeah, I put my moisturiser on first. Next I take my Smashbox, um, what is it, Photo Finish Foundation Primer. This is the pore minimising one which I love. Um, I take a small amount and I only actually apply it to the center of my face, if I can get any out. There we go. Um, just because it's a bit expensive and I can't afford to, if I am wearing makeup every day, um, put it all over my face. So I just kind of rub a bit together and I go like this, on my nose, on my forehead and on my chin. So yeah, I kind of ignore, ignore the outer area of my face, um, as I don't find I really need a prime there. Um, yeah, and then so next, I take my Nude by Nature um, Mineral Cover Powder, and this is in the shade Light Medium. Um, and I just tap a bit into the lid. This does get really messy, but I love it. So yeah, just tap some into the lid and then put my brush in it. And I, oh, I do um, tap my brush again just on a surface in front of you. Um, and then I just apply that all over my face. And I like to blend it down my neck, obviously. Um, this powder does come off a bit orangey. I don't know why. Um, but I still use it. <laughs> Then once I have done that, I like to take my Astralis Fresh and Flawless Press Powder. This is just in the shade Natural. Um, I just feel like it adds a bit more coverage. Um, and it also makes your makeup look softer, like smoother. I don't know. I love this powder. It is fabulous. Um, once I have applied my Fresh and Flawless Powder, I like to take the Sweet Peach Glow Palette by Too Faced, which mine looks a bit grotty because I use it all the time, but it's got the highlighter, blush, and the bronzer, and I use all three for my everyday makeup look. I just find it easy because you've got all three all together, easy for traveling and everything else. So I just take a Models Prefer airbrush, contour brush, I don't know, got it from Priceline, um, and I just take a little bit like that, and put it in the bronzer, tap it off, and then I just follow my, that bit of your ear down, and I just go to like about there, and I just blend it up and around my forehead and down under my jaw. I just find it adds a nice colour to the face. And Blend it all in and do the same on the other side. Um, next I take, I got these brushes off eBay. I don't know what they are, but they fall apart and I stick it tape back together. So I take this brush and I dip it into the blush. And I love the blush, so I often put a bit on. And I love this blush. I think it's a very nice natural colour. This palette also smells amazing. 
as most Too Faced products do. Um, I then take same set, a brush from the same set as the blush brush, um, but it's a pointy one. <laughs> um, and I take the highlighter, which is almost done, which I'm very sad about because it is beautiful. And I just apply that to the high points of my cheeks and down my nose and above my eyebrows, a little bit on my chin and on the cupid's bow. Um, now once I, so that's pretty much all I do for my face. Um, I then take my Too Faced chocolate bar palette which it's been loved. It looks very sad. Um, and I just take any kind of fluffy blender brush and I mix hazelnut, whole chocolate and milk chocolate all together. So that's that one, that one and that one. And I just run it through my crease. Like that, just to add a bit of definition. I don't do much to my eyes for an everyday look, just because I can't be bothered most of the time. Um, so yeah, just do that like so. And then, once we've done that, I take my eyelash curler and my Too Faced Better Than Sex mascara, which I've been using for years, a different one obviously because you run out, um, but I've been using that mascara for like two or three years now and I love it, I think it's so good. So yeah, curl the lashes, I kind of just pump them a bit like that. And the other one too. And then take a mascara. This one's actually pretty empty as well. And I just apply it to my top lashes. Mascara face. <laughs> oh. Um, and then I, so it's pretty much done, and then I will just take pawpaw cream, apply it to my lips, love this stuff, it's wonderful, and yeah, and then I take, I usually have a cheaper setting spray but I'm out, so I'll just take my Urban Decay D Sleek setting spray, and this one apparently you take it in like a T and an X and then I just like to fan myself until it's dry. Oh and I as you can tell I have quite thick eyebrows so I just take a um eyebrow brush and just kind of brush through them to make sure they're not going everywhere. And yeah that's basically it for my everyday makeup um look it's just natural simple very easy to do um and yeah i hope you guys enjoyed and i'll see you in my next video make sure you like and subscribe too yeah thanks bye